the match that kind of changed my life at first was the match with with Eunice. I think the rating on that match was close to 50 percent of of the country at some point was watching it. The trip to Starbucks the next morning was different. That was the match of my life. It wasn't the same after that, and until today, I see people. You know, they they come and they want to shake my hand and say well done for that match against uh, Roddick in Australia. I remember my coach kept saying, "Come on, just stay in there. Ten more minutes. Ten more minutes. Ten more minutes." I'm like, "You've been saying that for three hours." You know, so uh, but it's it's this weird thing because in the moment, looking back, you're like, how'd you do it for three hours? It's like, well, I didn't really do it for three hours. I did it for 10 minutes at a time. Once you're in the match, you know, you don't feel anything. There is only one thing that matters. It's to win the next point. So you really feel this on the day after, you know, when you wake up in the morning, that's when you realize you had a tough match yesterday. You get to, you know, 10 all, 12 all, 14 all, 16 all. 18 all was unheard of at that point. So you, you kind of realize you're part of something as you're doing it, probably finished three in the morning um, and no one had left. You really see the personality of someone in the court, you know, when he's uh, struggling or when you beat him, you know, how he's reacting. But uh, since that day, I, think, I mean, we have something special in common. We didn't know each other at all before that. And there will never be another moment where we're in the same room and we don't spend 15 minutes catching up.